Hey, what's up, you guys? This is Eric on Ninja XTX, and welcome to part 12 of my knife self defense series. First, let me start off by giving a, another quick shout out to Mr. John Fitzen and Malicious. Thank you guys for all the support. I hope you guys continue to watch. And continue to comment. Now, on to part 12 of my series. In parts 10 and 11, I began teaching you guys the basics of the back cut. Now, that is going to be, that is going to be built upon. Let's say you're here in this stance and you have an attacker that is coming with a stab straight in. What do you do? As it's coming straight in, you're here. So, as it comes straight in, instead of going in for the slash, Because all you're doing at that point is basically telegraphing what you're going to do. But, and there's a chance of him countering. But, as he comes in with a straight stab, all you do is turn your wrist over, flick his, or flick his blade, Cut his, hand, cut his hand and then come over and move in for a stab of your own. Now, as you come over, you're enveloping his blade, pushing his blade out. So... As he comes in with a straight stab, you turn to block or parry. As you parry, you do what? Push out, turn your hand back over, and stab. So, it's here from this position, turn the wrist, flick, flip back over, stab. So here we go again. You're in this position, you turn the wrist over to block or parry, you push out. You flick and you turn back over. Stab or thrust. Hope that made sense for you guys. Please take care of yourselves and each other. One world, one love. If you have any questions, comments, or requests, please send them to my YouTube account. Or if you know how to get in touch with me on Facebook, please send them to my Facebook account. Thank y'all. Love y'all. Bye-bye.